For decades, the engine of our digital age, the transistor, has been on an incredible shrinking spree. Moore's law saw these microscopic switches, the heart of every computer chip, become tinier and more numerous, fueling an explosion in computing power. At the core of each transistor is a gate, controlling the flow of electrical current, separated from the main channel by an insulating layer called the gate oxide. As engineers pushed for smaller, faster transistors, this insulating barrier had to become unimaginably thin, eventually just a few atoms across. And that's where the bizarre rules of the quantum world began to assert themselves, creating a profound challenge, quantum tunneling. Imagine an electron approaching this ultra-thin insulating wall. Classically, if it doesn't have enough energy, it should bounce off. But quantum mechanics paints a different picture. The electron, behaving like a wave, has a non-zero probability of simply passing through this classically insurmountable barrier. It doesn't break the barrier, it tunnels, as if a ghost phasing through a solid wall. For transistors, this is a critical problem. When the gate oxide becomes too thin, electrons begin to tunnel through it, even when the transistor is supposed